All right, so we've done soft entry and exit, hard entry and exit. Does anybody see any problems with those things? Where, where do you do them? It would be the, you know. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, we've got boxes out there to learn these things. Oh. We yeah. don't use boxes and matches. That's not, that's not how it works. So you're still going to do these things in very limited circumstances. Usually, what you're going to find yourself doing is something like this, where it's dynamic application of those things. Dynamic entry and exit. So let's say that I'm, this is my barricade, and I'm going to draw and shoot this popper. So how am I going to get out of this box? I'm going to shoot the way out of it. Shooting on the move, back to the And then what do we do? We see, we just did this, wide transition. <coughs> Shooting on the move, on the way in, and then finishing on the proper. Now, probably most guys come up to a match and they see a scenario like this, and they're just going to uh, shoot everything here. I'm going to run over here, and then shoot everything here. Right? Yeah. Well, we're learning that's not the efficient way to do things. So we're going to shoot our way out of a position and shoot our way into a position. Dynamic entry and exit. It's going to look slow, but it's going to be slow, and it's going to save time. All right, so let me demo this, what we're looking for here. What it is, is combining shooting on the move. You're gonna come in, shooting on the move, and then just stop. So we're gonna be in our, we're in our stance here. That mini popper is the hardest shot here. We're gonna have it in between our, the lines drawn straight out from our toes. That's how we're gonna end up. And that's also how we're gonna start. Everything in between is easy. So we're just gonna shoot on the move, right? This is application of what we've been doing. This is what you're gonna do in the matches.